Right now, I'm the envy of mums, dads, brothers, sisters, daughters and sons. It is Jake Crickenden! Hi. So Hannah Cox wants to know, who are your singing icons? Um, I love, like, I love Ed Sheeran, I love Ben Howard, Paolo Mantini, Daniel Merriweather, all those kind of guys, you know what I mean? Like, Justin Timberlake as well. And yeah, they're all great. I, I, I wish I wish I got a chance to sing an original song with my guitar, but it's one of those things. And it's the X Factor, and you've got to sing what. what See Ed last yeah. night. Yeah, incredible. Yeah, I've actually interviewed Ed when I worked for the Chart Show TV, so I've met him and he said hi and well done and all that. Yeah, he's, he's a really nice guy. Awesome. Now Melissa wants to know why are you so fit? <laughs> um, to know, ask my mum and dad. <laughs> to know, like that's. I don't know if I am, but thanks. The right answer is the gym. Oh yeah, the gym, yeah. <laughs> Just going to the gym. Now, La Chaine de Jolie, I don't know what that means, wants to know, what are the feelings you have when you're singing? Um, it depends what I'm singing, really. Like, I manage to connect well more with my songs that I've written, because they're my words. But you try and think about whatever the song's about. That's about it, really. Sometimes I don't think about it. Caitlin wants to know what do you feel went wrong or what would you like to have done to improve that performance? Um, just maybe not get as nervous and what went wrong, like, I don't know, like, everything's meant to happen and it was my time to leave, like, two years ago, it was my time not to get through it, everything worked out and I made it this time, so everything happens for a reason and I, I just, I could have fought more for my own stuff and my guitar back and showed the kind of person and artist that I wanted to be, but it's one of those things. Now Emma wants to know, what do you, who do you think will win the X Factor? Obvious question, but come on. Mm. Um, Andrea's a force to be reckoned with in his voice, but I also really like Paul and Ben and Jack. Kumari wants to know, what is going to happen to Bake? Bake will never die. We've already said this, like, I'll stay in touch with Ben and speak to him every day. He's like literally become one of my best mates in a short period of time, which is like weird. It's not very often you meet someone and you just get along straight away. We've got the same personality, we're both idiots. <laughs> yes, uh, well you're not, but you're, yeah, yeah I don't Now Dee wants to know, what's next for you? Maybe a place with the Pleasure Boys UK? Now that'll be worth seeing. What are the Pleasure Boys? I'm assuming they're naked men that do something. Really? On stage. Pleasure people. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, does she not mean the Dream Boys? I've actually been contacted by the Dream Boys. They wanted me to go on tour with them, so. What are you thinking? Probably not. <laughs>